I wanted to show you guys how to cancel the sign from this equation, but you may think that this right here is so easy. Let's just go ahead and cancel the sign right here and right here and say y is equal to x. Yes, so easy, but so wrong as well. Don't do this. And the reason is because sign is not injected, so we cannot just cancel the function. Here is the real deal. We actually have to consider cases. Here's case one. Well, look at sign y and sign y, no problem on that. But sign x right here, remember sign is a periodic function. So we look at x right here, but we will have to add 2n pi. We have to consider all the possibilities. And now we can legitimately cancel the sign right here and right here and say y is equal to this, which is x plus 2n pi. And of course, n is an integer, so let's write that down right here. So that's it for the first case. And now let's look at the second case. Well, here's the deal. Let's write down the sign of y again. And then right here, when we have x inside, it's actually the same as a, well, we can have pi minus x. This and that is going to be the same thing. And then again, sine is a periodic function. So right here, we will also have to add 2m pi because I used n over there already. And then let's go ahead and just cancel the sign right here and right here. And then you can see that we will just have y is equal to all this, which is pi minus x plus 2m pi. And of course, we could combine the pi's together. So we will have 2m plus 1 minus x. And this right here, again, m is an integer, and then we are done.